Sometimes an exquisite item can be found within an unassuming package. And this is one of those times. This is an antique Flageolo singing bird box. Flageolo manufactured bird boxes in Paris, France. And this is one of his early examples. Before we play the bird box, there's another little surprise. So inserted into the top of the inside of this box was the original calling card of Mr. Flageolot in Paris, France that goes with this singing bird box. That is something you do not see often. I'm going to put a glove on. Bear with me. <clears throat> it has the original winding key, which is in this little recess of this box. And I need to get it out with my finger. There we go. I went through everything, cleaned, adjusted, and lubricated all of the mechanics. The bellows work perfectly. The gold gilt case is just gorgeous. This is the original finish, and gold cleans up really nicely. What's neat about this box is the compartment underneath. So what happens is the bird box actually tilts back with a very strong secure hinge and then you can see the compartment below which is also all gold gilt and that's where you wind it from. I've already wound the box. Let's hear it play. See it operates perfectly. The bird feathers are in incredibly nice condition. Let's do this again. This bird has a bone beak. There's tiny little feet underneath the bird that clutch an orb. The feathers are iridescent red, greens, blues. Looks like there's some orange. And so how you wind this, so you open this up, you take the key, you insert it into the winding arbor, and the mainspring winds smoothly. The mechanism runs quietly. You can just hear the slight whir of the governor fan. And that's common on your antique singing bird boxes because the mechanism is all solid brass. There aren't any plastic parts. I think this is one of the prettiest bird boxes that I've seen in a while. And clearly, based upon the condition of the, the bird feathers, the condition of the gold finish. Oftentimes the gold gilt is all worn off over the years of use. Um, whoever owned this box took care of it and it was stored in the right conditions. Um, the original box with the original sales card. Um, this is a real survivor. So in summary, an antique French singing bird box, and this is numbered 519 by the way, and so the movement is also signed Flageolot with the number 519, 
and in one of my reference books written by Mason on antique singing bird tabatiers, he references a flageolet bird box that was numbered 1248, I believe. And Mason, who is an expert on antique tabatiers, dated that box to circa 1900. This has a number 519, which is much less than 1248. Clearly, it's earlier than the box dated 1248. So that would put this box somewhere in the 1800s, most likely the, the late 1800s, because that's when Flageolet started making singing bird boxes. Long video, but it's a special item. Take care.